Look at our future. So what are we going to do? I challenge all of men to stand up. Whether you're a daddy or whatever, stand up, man. Let us go and do something about our children soon. They're telling us every day. Every day. They're reaching out every day for us. And look like we want to keep turning our back. It's not a hard thing to do. We were children. Huh? So why don't we give back? I'm ready. I've been waiting a long time. I've been doing all over 40 years. I worked with children all over this community. And everything was charity. I'm not in here for money. Because I said before, my investment is in the truth. Um, I'm Lance I'm from the Anthropology Department at USF. We got together and we came up with the idea of, of making a DVD, which would have um, people sharing their, their memories about Taft, um, performances, uh, any kind of contribution that someone wanted to, you know, to leave in memory of Taft. As far as I'm concerned, there's not a greater person that has been in the midst of us. A lot of stuff experienced, uh, things that we wouldn't have experienced if it hadn't been for him. Brilliant, brilliant man. And all the people I have met in my long time of interviewing artists, both those people called fine artists and those people called folk artists, he is certainly a the very top of the list of people who I would say is extraordinarily, was extraordinarily brilliant. Just a spiritual man, a wise man. I think he's a very spiritual, he was a very spiritual person. And he was very in tune to a lot of things that a lot of people kind of dismiss. And I think he was very open to that type of knowledge and that type of um, information coming from other sources that you may typically discount. I want to say Tab. So if you spell the name out, you got T A F T. Am I correct? Yeah. When I see that, I see terrific, artistic. I'm gonna come back to the artistic part. Terrific, artistic, fantastic, and last but not least, trill. He was so trill with everybody. He never faked the phone. He was really a genius, and he was a genius in his art. And he was a sort of, like you say, some sort of spiritual healer in his life. And we need more of them. No, I'm not a great speech maker or anything, but I know Taft since maybe 70 when I, he was protesting the art show. I went to the Gaspro art show and I looked around, me and my mom, and after the show, here's a guy outside the show having a show. That was the best show, it was the whole thing. I don't, that's the only one I remember. <laughs> Mr. Richardson, Taft Richardson, was such a wonderful in inspiration to my students and I. And I just want to say that he is truly, truly, truly missed. And uh, he did such amount of work in terms of sharing uh, the history and knowledge of the, the community of Spring Hill uh, with my students. And just inspiring them to... to um, just reach beyond themselves. So to clean up your trash of all the negative thoughts that crash and wreckage, I have been chosen by God to deliver this message. Reaching myself into the furthest of your mind's inner world teaches.